Greetings and salutations, dear viewers. I hope this thing's on. Welcome to another Fragment Friday. Fragment Friday, as those of you who do not know, is where I, accompanied by Madam Barry, who rejoins us this week. The chat's debating where I am. Oh. Where am I? I'm not. I'm not sure. If you're not sure, I'm not sure. You never really explained precisely that to me. Uh, I'm sorry. We don't know. We're still figuring that one out. <laughs> but we're rejoined by Madam Barry. Uh, Fragment Friday is where the two of us typically play Dot Hack Fragment, among other things. And the cool thing about Dot Hack Fragment. is that I get to play it alongside all of you. Um, if you want to get Dot Act Fragment up and running, there's a link, just one or two links below the actual stream that says something in the vein of, so you want to play Dot Act Fragment. Go there, it'll run you through a huge list of tutorials and all kinds of fun stuff that will ev eventually get you up and running. So, good news! Somebody asked who I am. I'm Barry. Yeah. <laughs> and that is one dollar in from Professor Litwick, who says, Sup, Naka. As you may have guessed from there, not only do I get to play alongside all of you, I also have the chat up on the side of the screen, which means I get to chat with all of you. Now, if you do really want to get my attention, there's going to be... I'm going to be doing a lot of stuff, there's going to be a lot of dialogue going by in the chat, I may not get to read everything that's said. If you really want to... One dollar in from Kaiser, who says, Welcome back, Barry. Also, hello, Naka. Small donation this week due to circumstances. Won't get into it, sort of personal, sorry. Though I am happy to be here, but Naka Eternal. It's Om Naka. It's but Naka. I'm back to say that again. And thank you very much, Kaiser. You take care of yourself, all right? Uh, with all that said, though, um, if you do really want to get my attention in the chat, just put, like, either, I'm guessing, type my name, as Kaio Kane did, or at Nakate, or something to the vein, something of that sort. It'll show up in a big black box. It's just more likely to catch my eye if I've only got half a second to glance at the chat. That doesn't necessarily mean I'm still going to catch it, but I'll try my best. $20 in from Kuma! Who says, oh man, Barry's back. One more week till I'm on vacation. No board games tonight, but I will be sleeving cards used in Splendor and Star Realms. Have fun. Thank you very much, Kuma. Okay, so with all that said, uh, we're playing Dot Hack Fragment. We can play with all of you guys. You can, If you want to play the game, there's a link down there. We also accept uh, donations, as you may have guessed. Now, the cool thing about donations, the highest donation of the evening, gets to add a keyword to the server, because we're actually going to be playing Fragment on my own private server. You can see in the lower right-hand corner of the screen, if you want to join in, it's Peach Boot. Peach Boot? Peach Boot. So, that's cool. Uh, when you donate, you can leave a comment for me, which I will then read aloud. If you want to donate anonymously, you can. If you don't want to leave a comment, you can do that, too. I'm pretty sure the place that the tips go through to get to me accepts uh, PayPal, credit, debit, e-check, you name it. So, that's the thing. I think that's all I can think of. I'm dancing. You are. Because you go on a really long spiel. I got a lot to say at the start of these streams, man. I gotta keep the people up and running that aren't, like, always in the know. Okay, so I should probably do a thing. This music is super nostalgic and it's super cool and I like it and it just makes me want to play Dot Hack. <laughs> We're sort of going to be playing Dot Hack. Oh man, Tanaberry. Tanaberry. It's been so long. Oh man, you're level 10. I know. You're... I've cleared I've cleared <laughs> into the double digits. You're getting there. Kind of. I'm just like level 20. It's 10 levels higher than me. I've got a big old grandpa on my staff. <laughs> what level am I? What level am I? I'm maybe 23? 
I think I'm over 20. Somebody asked how my trip thing went. It went pretty good. I was at my parents. They were at work a whole lot, so I was mostly in my room by myself. Working on visual out. Page games. Oh, I'm 21. Your drinking age. <laughs> What's up, Sodies? Not sure. I'm hoping I'm pronouncing your name right. It's actually Sodez. <laughs> That's so bad. I'm sorry. Problems. What? Oh, there's somebody actually <laughs> in. Problems. Wait, did, is Peach Boot up? Not yet. Oh, okay. I just gotta get to it. Oh, this one's actually just straight up called Makanu. <laughs> Alright. Do what you gotta do. Okay, booting up Peach Boot. It's one of these. Reloading. Peach Bootin'. Peach Bootin'. Ah, the server crashed. Oh no! I wonder if the server crashes if like <laughs> if like f I've been more disconnected. Than three people try to join at the same time or something. Hmm. I don't know. Or maybe even more than one person tries to join at the exact same time. Being disconnected, being disconnected. Look at all that disconnecting I'm doing. Do -do. Do -do. What's up, Blue Dragon God? Tur you turned that off? Turned what off? Yeah. Oh. It made noise. <laughs> so was the AC. One dollar in from SS2Jet, who says, Oh man, Barry's back. I began playing Zone of the Enders, the second runner, recently. Got to the Vic Viper fight and was reminded by how much you flipped out over all the references. Never change. And th followed by twenty dollars from Yggdrasil, who left the comment that was the exact same number of lines as SS2Jet, at the exact same time that I changed from line two to line three, so... I almost continued reading Yggdrasil's comment at the end of SS2 Jets. Good job. Uh, Yggdrasil says, Hi, Nock and Barry. I'm currently playing Final Fantasy XIV while watching the stream. Feels good to be back after my week-long vacation, but I have a lot to catch up on my free company. Also, the key word is Alexander. Peach Bootin. Peach Bootin. Hopefully it doesn't crash this time. It's working. It's thinking about it. Ooh. Oh, it's a guy. What's oh. your deal? Hello, uh, NPC. Something about, something about CC Corp. I think those are three keywords we CC. go to. Okay, somebody remember those keywords. <laughs> Would it not be in, like... Get out of the menu. Would it be in... Is it this? I don't know. Okay, let me talk to this guy again. Hey, guy. 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 Oh, guy. can I not... I can't talk to him. Ah! <laughs> Crap, are you doing? Me? I was <laughs> trying, trying to, to trade with me or something. <laughs> I was trying to talk to the guy. 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 Another player is busy. Guy. It should be uh, a word list. One. Yeah, word it? list. That looks close enough to be a level 80. Huh? We got this. Yes. 
Hey, Advent Azure, I apologize profusely. Are you doing it? Yes! Oh god. We can't just not go into a level 80 area. Oh no. <laughs> he speaks in tongues. <laughs> oh man, he's like level 44. Heck yeah, we got this! Uh, man, Advent Azure is gonna wreck. Actually, we're all gonna get wrecked, but whatever. I mean... Hey, remember that one time in the quadrilogy when I went to like a level 80 area at the beginning of the game? We can do this. The chat's just going, oh god. Okay, I'm just gonna stand here and wait a second. And see if anything comes to greet us. I'm not seeing anything coming to greet us. I'm not even look. Oh, there's a portal. Yeah, okay, accuracy up. Okay, I see a portal. Let's do this thing. Uh. You okay? You need me to stay, need me to stop moving? I, I, he said, like, do still or something. I didn't catch the first one. I, I think he was trying to type, do we still oh. something. Heathers! Heathers! <laughs> ah! This is going to be so bad! Oh my goodness. Uh. Quick, resume. Oh! Ow! I'm running. You got this! I'm running! You got this! You know, other than that whole no! taking. Go! I was oh confused. dear! Oh dear! You know, other than that whole doing seventeen hundred damage to him, we were actually doing pretty good. No, I'm not level ten. Yeah, we leveled down too. You did this to me. <laughs> yeah, we all kind of died too. Leveling down in this game is a jerk thing, though. I apologize very much. I apologize. I apologize profusely. Okay, well, let's not do that again. Let's go somewhere we can actually fight. You did this to me! Yes, yes. We all leveled down. Yes, but I was in the double digits. <laughs> and now I'm not. <laughs> because of you. <laughs> Just five more episodes for Barry to hit level ten again. No, I'm pretty sure it's, it's going to be more than that. I'm pretty sure it's going to be like another 20 episodes before I hit level 10 again. Thanks! I get it! <laughs> I leveled down too! How long it's going to take to get back a thousand experience points at this level? Yes, but you had cleared the double digits. Twerk! Want twerk? <laughs> okay, we should have... Yeah, we should be able to wreck this easy enough. I'm just attacking them all like once so you can get some attacks in if you want. Let's try a fairy orb. Now we can just go places. I mean, really, what else am I using this money for? Can only you see it? Yeah. Okay, that'd, well then we'll follow you. That'd be my guess. Enemy. Rogue enemy. I'm on fire. I did 16 damage I've been it. unfired. Halt! Ow! I don't have enough SP for anything. Okay, here, I'll just kill that guy. Are we all good? Oh, there's another guy. Ah! <laughs> Who else wants some? I'm not gonna get any SP like this, or uh, experience like this. I'm just gonna get none. Well, if you can do any damage at all, you get experience for it. Let me... Oh, uh, I can't do it now. Oh man, it got triggered. I'm not gonna get any experience with Azure running around. I just attack... Like, wrecking everything. Because for one, I need to get a different weapon. 
Oh yeah, because like your weapon only like the spells cost so much. Yep. That did zero damage. Oh boy. Well, you know what? Um, much as I like the experience, let's go get to a place where you can get experience. Well, I... The problem isn't that I can't kill the enemies. It's that my spells cost so much. Well, let's go get you another weapon. I think I have one. Let me just equip it. I just need it to be out of battle mode. Okay. Oh no, I've apparently had twin laser beams blasted in my face. see here, SBMP always runs out faster than HP and AP. That depends. Especially later on in a lot of games, it gets to the point where like your HP runs out super quick and you're just like burning through MP to heal yourself. And so like because you're being healed so constantly, your SP almost becomes your HP bar. Like, you'll die when you run out of HP. That depends on the game, though. Let me see my skills. So really the one I need to not use. Hey, you got some tens. I also apologize to you, Advent Azure. I can't imagine what it takes to level up at that level. <laughs> okay. I should be okay. Okay. Mon ami! <laughs> Mushroom! Mushroom! Give me! Oh, something's coming for us. I did one damage. Heck yeah. Oh, I'm getting wrecked. I'm getting wrecked! Die already, you sack of crap. Die! Oh, he's already dead. Do more than zero damage! Especially if you're doing zero damage, here you don't want to go to a lower level area. I don't know, I just feel like everyone's gonna kill everything before I can touch it. Yeah, all we have to do is actually technically we don't even have to hit it once. We only have to hit it once if we want experience. Okay, I kill them in one hit. I can kill the- I can- I can hit the mantis things. I can deal one damage to the mantis things. See, everyone's been saying that, like, if you don't miss, even if you deal zero damage, you still get credit, and you still get experience, which I have not ever found to be true. Hmm. I've been very intently watching my experience, and if I do zero damage to something, I- do not get experience. Whoops. Sorry. The Max! Didn't mean to attack that one a second time. Which one? Oh, the Max for me is 24 experience. Largest is 33. 
or some such. I can consistently hit the mantis things. All right. Okay, killed one of them. Oh, there's some swords going around. Oh, I'm gonna get wrecked! I'm killing this mage! Oh no! I'm dead! Uh, help! Help! I'm back! Hey, you. I can't hit the swords. That's the only one that I can't deal damage to. Okay, that one's dead. Swords. Come here, swords. No! I found a spell that can do damage to the swords! <laughs> well, it's... Hit it. There it goes. Okay. <laughs> that was weird. Well, that's like server lag and all of that. Despite that we're running on my own server. <laughs> uh, would I be able to set up Tengu later, or is Tengu not around? We have Tengu, but it takes long enough to set up that I wouldn't do it in the middle of a... I wouldn't do it in the middle of a stream. Oppo. Oppo. It's a chest. Dot, 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 dot. Keyboard of pain! pain. Oh, we're fighting something. Oh, you're back here. It's a mage. Mage lady. If everybody waits to kill something until I've gotten one hit on it, then, like, I can get experience here. Elemental weakness! Oh no! Oh no! That's one witch down. <laughs> rip main! Or not rip main, um, rough, whatever. These big guys are rough, man. Did you hit the big guy? Oh no. I don't know, I was trying to hit the little guy. Okay, well, big guy's been hit now. Okay. Hit the little guy. There we go. I've hit everything once. Everything can die now. Yay! It's all about working together like a team. If memory serves, technically it only saves when you log out, so if we like just hard reset it won't save. I don't know. Oh my gosh, so many guys. So many guys I think who you I'm hit this not guy. hitting. Come here. Why am I suddenly doing zero damage to you? There we go. It's what I do! Yay! Yay! Okay, that looks like everything on the field. Yeah, I saw the all portal open. Yeah. So... Want to log out? So you can make sure to keep that? Yeah. And then we can just blitz to the dungeon? Yep. I mean, Arc Nephilim made it. Can nobody jump in in her place? <laughs> I mean, even if somebody does, I'm level 10 now, so I don't feel horrible. Yeah, uh, Fragment saves when you log out from the world. So if you just close the game, you lose nothing. So, uh, hey, Azure! Oh, Moonspeak. So hey Azure, if you want to keep uh if you want to keep that experience just like <laughs> What did he 
you say? I think, I think the game wants to corrupt me. Oh. Yeah, if you want to keep that experience you lost, you can always just, uh, turn off the console. <laughs> back. Yay! Let's go back to the level 80. No! I will boycott this stream. <laughs> so you'll just, like, just peace out? No, I'll peace out and then I'll start screaming heavy metal in the background. <laughs> That's not really... Boycotting it's the, the stream. only way I know how to boycott this stream while living in this <laughs> apartment. It's not really <laughs> what boycotting is. It is to me. Like boycotting is avoiding the use of, not actively tampering with. Man, that spell doesn't do anything to him. There we go. Gotta look at that elemental weakness. Gotta remember your dot hack elemental wheel. The problem is that I don't remember which spells are assigned to which keys. Oh, well, that'll do it. Um, oh no! Oh, oh no! Well, we got you like 25 more experience points. <laughs> All right, well, uh, hopefully he comes back here in a minute. I'm not too far from 21. I mean, it'll still be a little while, but... <laughs> yeah, he's coming back. I come stronger. <laughs> okay, we're going back in. I'm trying. Oh, no. You made me stop doing the thing. $22 in from Ark Nephilim, who says, Hey, Nock and Barry, how are you guys? I missed the last few streams, so here's a donation for you. Thank you very much, Ark Nephilim. Honestly, you didn't miss much. Barry hasn't been here the last few weeks, and I've had some really laid back, some really laid back streams. Okay, this was the one that hits this guy, and this was the one that hits that guy. I've hit both of them. They Yay! Adventizure isn't even getting experience for <laughs> these. Somebody made a hashtag berry boycott. <laughs> Wait, that sounds like you're boycotting me. Let's go to a dungeon! Are you boycotting me? I guess that would be sad, but I don't, I don't really have anything to say about that. <laughs> Yeah, the last couple streams, uh, Ark Nephilim, you haven't missed out a lot. They were super relaxed, super laid-back streams. Um, I just kind of pooed around in Final Fantasy XIV, did quests, leveled up. Guild of Dungeoneering. A friend at work actually told me about that when I looked into it. It looked interesting. I'd probably be more... Oh, I kill these guys in one hit. <laughs> I do five damage to that guy. That's more damage than the other damages. 
$23 in from Professor Litwick, who says, Naka, I am very upset at you because now I am addicted to Trove and can no longer be a functional member of society. To show my anger, I will throw money at you because that makes sense. That's an attack in Pokemon. Keyword, cheesecake. <laughs> oh, that is a keyword, too. Thank you very much, Professor Litwick. Oh, so I think Admin Azure just told us the elemental wheel. Wood weak to earth and vice versa. And he said like it was like water and thunder, I think mm. was the other one. No, thunder weak to dark. So it's water weak to earth. I don't know. That's how the elemental wheel works. No, we don't want to go that way. That's how the elemental wheel works in dot hack though is I think there's six elements and they each have a pair and they're weak to each other. Are they the Chinese elements? I don't Would, think, I think so. so. I, I because think like there's no more... metal. Yeah there is. I mean they're n not in dot hack. Oh right. I thought you were talking about Ow! What's wrong with you? Okay, which one are you? I can't Okay, you hit you hit the little one. Yeah. I hit the big one too. Oh, okay. I can hit him again. <laughs> Just gotta run up and like smack him. Just club him. Me? Yeah. That's what the problem is. I would miss. And then he would hit me. Oh, there's only two floors in this dungeon. And then I would die. Uh, Guild of Dungeoneering, though. A friend showed me that one. I've not had a chance to really look into it too much. It looked kind of neat, but it looked like something that I would play a lot of if I was playing it, like, on my phone or something at work. <laughs> like, as far as playing it at home goes, I... There's a reason I stopped playing Clicker Heroes. It's fun, and I enjoyed doing it. I just need to... Uh... <laughs> I don't know if I miss the moon speak. <laughs> it was fun, and I enjoyed doing it, but, like, I just... I don't have as much time as I even thought I had, so, like, I gotta get to work on crap. Yay. I can't see shit on this computer right now. I think I turned the brightness down a little while ago. Hmm. Is nobody going to get these chests? I'm not. Alright. I'm not using them for anything. <laughs> I'd probably lose them. Hit the one guy. Hit that guy. And... Well... Ah! <laughs> well... Ah! Yeah, Clicker Heroes was fun, though. I'd like to continue it, but, like, I just... I need to use that time on in more productive ways. Trove was super fun, though. We don't play that as much as we used to either, but I think both of us have also just gotten to work on stuff more. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Bye. Oh no. I'm humping a wall. Carry on without me. Well, that was fun while it lasted. No, they finally boycotted her. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, I guess me and you can finish this dungeon, Advent Azure. The dungeon's just two floors, so we're effectively almost done. I'm pretty sure Azure can solo it. 
Um, did I finish the Heaven's Ward main story? And if so, that final boss fight. Yes, I did indeed finish the Heaven's Ward main story. I'm currently I-163, saving up tomes to... saving up tomes and, um... hunt mark things to upgrade my crap. I'm thinking it shouldn't take too terribly long before I'm I-170. So I can actually give uh, Alexander a try. Waiting. <laughs> oh, let's see. How complicated is this dungeon? Not that comp. Not, this floor is not that bad. Dead guy, where are we going? We're going this way. Oh, so now there's a hashtag SaveBerry. <laughs> I got a newt necklace. Have I heard that there's a Metroid 2 fan remake floating around out there? I think I'd maybe heard of that, but... I don't know, I haven't heard too much about it. I would at least be interested in uh, looking into that, though. Because one of the main reasons I didn't really play much of, of um, Metroid 2... I mean, I played through it. I beat the game. But, like, one of the reasons it's just not one of my favorite Metroids is because... Because it's on the Game Boy, you cannot tell one section from another. And you just get so lost. <laughs> like, one room looks like another room looks like another room. One area looks like another area looks like another area. If you want to go this fast, you got to wake up at 5 in the morning every day! Hundred push-ups, hundred sit-ups, hundred squats, and run five kilometers every day, without fail. In three years' time, you'll be a superhero. Guess that was it. Ah. Jeez, my cure doesn't even heal him all the way. I don't need the pity. It's training. He opened a trap chest. Then I healed him and he just said, I don't need the pity. <laughs> all right, let's get the crap out of here. Yeah, in Twilight Winter, it's not that, like, I dislike the graphics in Metroid 2. Like, oh no, the graphics are so bad. It's when the graphics act actually affect gameplay is when it ceases to be enjoyable. And, like, when you can't tell where you are in an exploratory game, there's a problem. <laughs> okay, we got an extra open space, though, so if somebody wants to hop on... Give me an Advent Azure some company, feel free. Okay, he's got a plan. So about that level 80 area. <laughs> I have 99 resurrects on shortcut. Oh god. Carrot Sticks asks me if he... if I want him to... Recolor the sprite you made in Peach Boot to match the design drawn a while back. Ah, uh, keep it as pink. 
<laughs> so I will res you and uh, run for the hills. <laughs> okay, so I'll just run up and hack at him. You punch him once, and then and get rezzed. And then punch him again and get rezzed. Admittedly, I don't know if I would be able to take a regular attack from one of those or not. Um, I know that what they those things used to kill us was a summon spell. Oh god. Which are like the most powerful spells in the game. So, yeah, no wonder we got hit for 1700 damage. <laughs> Wham and Azure. Those two can get us through the area. Well, I'll give that a thought, Azure. I'll give it a good hard think. I don't have a lot to get rid of. Because I don't pick up anything anymore. <laughs> Alright, that's all I got. Oh, it wants to trade. Uh, okay. <laughs> oh, I guess not. Okay, done doing what I'm doing. So if anybody is around that can uh, hop on. Okay, Air Gamer can join. Just not sure to join with. Whoever you want to join with, Air, we'll make do. Yeah, don't worry, it should only take about 87 reses to defeat one mob. We put- we could hit him! That was the cool thing, we could hit him! Mm -hmm. And we actually started chipping away at their HP. Like, if we didn't get hit for 1700 damage, it was actually a reasonable amount of damage. Like, we could have taken him. I mean, Gurren Dai finally got a character to level 50 in Final Fantasy. <laughs> okay, so I think Air said he was going to get on, just didn't know what character to play as. Then why didn't I dodge? I was frozen. I couldn't move. I was scared. Oh. Okay. I have 19 Resurrects. I have a health drink. I have 19 Resurrects. I don't need too many. I can't take that many. I can't hold that many Resurrects. I can't hold that many resurrects. I have a health drink. Oh god, it's that cat again. I think that I cat that runs into the glass door on the French baking show. <laughs> oh, and a virus core. That's spiffy. Huh. What servers do you even go to? Or are you just playing through the main story? I don't know. What do I do? Do I hit that? Oh, I guess. I think that's like modify trade or something. No, I think that was it. I think I was waiting on him. Hmm. Oh man, I've got 99 resurrects. Alright, as soon as somebody gets on, we can go take that level 80 area. We got this.
But why did the baking shop keep the clip of that cat? <laughs> I don't know, but they Why used... would you get rid of it? They used it as a transition to, like, a different segment of the <laughs> show, which was great. Like, if you translated it, it said something like... And we weren't the only ones to encounter any surprises today. Cat, cat, heck, funk! <laughs> Still waiting on somebody else. Well, Air's trying. Hmm. Air's internet's being a butt. Hmm. Well, if anybody else is handy, though. I don't know if I was just film if I was filming and I filmed that like yeah I'd feel bad for the cat but I'm not gonna like just delete the film <laughs> I'm gonna keep that crap so it eases back <laughs> okay PS2 is online air is working his way in Oh, man. Oh, he wants to trade again. I don't know. What are you giving me? Ocean gloves. Have a health drink. Ocean gloves, eh? Oh my, that is some stuff. Hmm. What level is that? Level 63. Heck yeah, I'll equip those. Oh, you can't change the equipment of party members. What? I don't wanna. What? But, I don't wanna. Is that your equipment? There we go. That, that was I, weird. I don't know, man. I don't know how things work. Air's on! Oh, man! Oh, man, air's up there, too. Holy crap. Ooh. Hey, air, how many resurrects do you have? Oh, God, no. Don't. I got it on Azure. That was, I don't know. It was causing a fuss, it's like but just a weird I got it on. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Now remember, if we game over, don't log out. Does the Miss Naka spread of a mouth that moves when Naka talks? Yes! It's Wop Wop Naka. Wop Wop. Technically, it also talks when Barry talks. Wop Wop. So it's a little more confusing in that regard, but... It's still a Wop Wop Naka. It's a Wop Wop Naka. Wop! I'm super proud of how that came out, though. Yeah, it works super nice. Ball. All right, Air, we're going to go get wrecked. Someone just goes... Oh, wait, Barry isn't there, lol. I'm not? Aw. Oh. oh, man, it was like a one-time event. We can't go back. What? It's not in your... What? Yeah, the, because the NPC's not standing there anymore. It was like that level just for the event. Because, like, it... There is no word list anymore, and if I go to Warp History, I can go there, but it's level 14. What? Man, it was a one-shot deal. What? Well, Poe. What? What? Go there anyway. Go there anyway out of spite and kick everything's ass. Yes! We're gonna go here and we're gonna wreck.
going to go here and we're going to show them what for. <laughs> It's the same area. See a guy. We are now vengeful ghosts. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, they meant that I was no longer in the party. I was confused because I thought that they training. Meant Ooh. Like, we're just all gonna go split up and wreck everything then, I guess. <laughs> Battle mode on. Who wants some? Okay, he wants some. Hm. I saw a portal. Wrecking! Wrecking! I got healed somehow. No. What the heck did Advent Azure get hit by? Ooh. And twenty-four dollars in from Kyo Kane, who says, "I'm getting ready to clear Alexander Floor Four someday, maybe before Savage comes out." But keyword, Hoshifarant. What? Oh my goodness! I hope he wins. I want that to be a keyword so bad. You could just put it in. It's your server. I could. Wait, no. Is it too many letters? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think it's too many letters. Oh, no. Ah. Uh, I think there's a 10 character maximum. No! Well, if there's not a 10 character maximum, I'm putting that one in one way or the other. What if there is? If there is, then maybe I'll, like, find a letter to remove. <laughs> there's a lot of letters in that. Okay, I don't know where I'm going. I'm not seeing anything. I think most everything has been sufficiently wrecked. Oh, field portals all open. I guess they used the, uh, I guess somebody used a fairy orb. To the dungeon. Well... <laughs> Dead tree. You guys just chilling over here? Come on, come on, guys. Let's. I want to know another enemy. Dead guy. BRB downloading the orc dating sim. <laughs> Let's go to dungeon. It's an orc dating sim. Hmm. What could go wrong? <laughs> Kill the trees. They're a menace to society. <laughs> Did he get hit with a death or something? I imagine he just opened a trap chest when Azure got hurt. Like, honest to goodness, that's the only thing that could hurt him here. <laughs> Can't move. Getting spells cast on me. Uh, Kaioken has a suggestion for if it's too many letters. Yeah. I mean, that's an idea. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Alright, I'm playing the orc dating sim. I'll update you all live as to what <laughs> happens. The yeah, Advent Azure was saying something about a huge city and a whale.
Getting wrecked. How many dungeons? This is a fl four floor dungeon. Okay, maybe we don't have to clear the entire dungeon. Four floors of vengeance is a bit much. There is a read me. We'll just beeline to the bottom and then get out. Go somewhere productive. I'm posting a link to the orc dating sim in the- Ah, I'm not signed into Twitch. Thanks. Whale dungeon. What is my Twitch password? There is never enough vengeance! That is a funny looking Moogle. I mean, it's a Moogle. Did I not write down my Twitch password? Why do I not do the things? Hmm. Why don't I do the things? Like none of your passwords. Well, look, this is all of my passwords. That's a lot of passwords that are written down. None of the ones that I apparently care about. I love seeing these guys oh that, like, get killed and then don't get killed. You know what? I don't care. I'll take care of it later. Like, these guys run around with zero HP before they eventually die. Yeah, it's getting a little warm. It is. I like how you just look at my face. And you know well, what I, I knew- I saw what you were looking at. Okay, where are we going? We're going, we're going up. I'm going to play the orc dating sim. Uh, no, my Facebook is not linked to my Twitch. I'll figure out what my password is later. Well, with people talking about, like, emoticons, and the funny emoticons and stuff, I still think I really want to make, like, Twitch partner at some point. I don't even care about, like, any amount of money. I just really want to make Twitch partner at some point, just so I can add my own emoticons, and I want to add, like, a... I want to add a bunny. <laughs> I want to add dead bunny. That'd be so great. I wonder if I could get away with a picture of a butt. Like, I wonder if they'd let me. <laughs> Maybe a peach. Peach. Yeah, we could get away with a peach. A peach butt. Okay, I'm resetting my password for probably what is the thousandth time, because I don't know how many times I've forgotten this password. Like, a peach with a really pronounced butt? Yeah. Oh, it'd be great! Ah! <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> Just keeps opening these trap chests. Man, that tree is not messing around. I got one experience point for it. Could use Frank or Z if I don't want to go with the partner around. It's not Frank or Z just isn't the same as having like a peach butt and having a dead bunny. It's just not the same. You have to have the dead bunny. You have to have the Unyu. Unyu. 
Well, it's not really a bud, it's a peach. Let's just make ohms. Hmm. Okay, I'm writing this down now. Because I'm stupid. It's an unyu bunny. Turtle. Hey, where are we going? We're going, we're going... Going south. Look at the little icon! Can't see it from here. I'll check it's it out little, later. It's a tiny pink-haired girl. I'm pretty sure she's the mascot of Renpi. Renpi? Okay, I'm starting... Does the music in this game? Still going down. Starting the game. Ohm butts. Ohm butts. Yeah, we did the thing. Any who wants it? Nobody wants it, I'll take it. Okay, I'll take it. I gotta resurrect. I got one of my health drinks back. I can disable or enable not safe for work content. Well. At least they give you the choice. Yeah. That's nice. I wasn't honestly expecting there to be any. I knew there would be some because they mentioned it a couple of times. I mean, that's even more concerning, why really. It, why is it concerning? It's, orc's gotta get their thing on. It's an orc <laughs> dating sim! Alright. You're not a human. <laughs> I don't think. This isn't like Hatoful Boyfriend. <laughs> this isn't bestiality. <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm enabling it. All right. They mention in in the Tumblr post this particular version of the game, which is the first out of 14 days in the game. The only real not safe for work content in this particular version is um, mostly in the form of one of the orcs Sithig speaking out loud without really thinking. Mm. <laughs> Apparently. Operation Vengeance completed. Tusks also includes an optional NPC autonomy feature wh where other characters can make decisions on their own that may sometimes overrule or contradict yours. That sounds fascinating! Hmm. I am now ready to begin the game. Cutting level 60 areas? Well, if I did, I would be on that crap. I'm lucky to get a level 20. <laughs> I don't know what I've got to do to get this server leveled up. 18. I'll try for a 19 or a 20. But 18's up there. 19. Let's try 19. Like, that's the highest I can get. If I could get higher levels, I would. Good evening, Arrow. Hi. Gonna go wreck face. Ooh, he nulls thunder. My my default name is apparently Shoe Bag. <laughs> nope, it's Barry. My name is Barry. Shoeberry. 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 Getting some interesting enemies showing up. I've not seen most of these before.
Anybody else alive? Man, why are these flying guys gotta be so hard to hit? Okay, I hit that one. I hit both of them! If you can kill them, do the thing! Other than just, like, going to the single player, how in the world do you guys get that high level? Are there actually servers at that level now? These orcs all seem very personal. This one is flowers! <laughs> that orc is covered in flowers! I like him. The green on these guys keeps making me think they're data bugs. <laughs> Pull up a boulder! <laughs> single player is what they're telling me is how you get that high level. Oh. Like you just can't get servers high enough level to... <laughs> no, stop attacking me. I want to attack the harpy. Well, I guess I'm not attacking the harpy. I guess they're all dying. They just all kind of died. Wait, no, I didn't want to trigger that. There's a harpy coming. I apparently sat down on a boulder that is described as distinctly uncomfortable. <laughs> Man, so many guys coming out of nowhere. Guys everywhere. I'm getting smacked. I leveled up. Oh man, I didn't use it before. I didn't use my congrats thing when you leveled up. Mm. How did I manage to get through the Tower of Pain and Bunny Must Die without breaking my keyboard? Getting through the Tower of Pain on its own wasn't that big a deal. The hard part was getting through the Tower of Pain without the wall jump. Without the wall jump, or the dash boots, or the gears. Which all, which prevented me from getting the busty suit. Which... didn't make it for a good time. There was a lot of guard blocking involved in getting up it in the first place. The platformer sections of it, anyway. The bosses came and went as being difficult, but like... Oh my goodness, the final boss of that was a nightmare. Like, I did not think the final boss of the Tower of Pain was as hard as it wa as she was. But, like, the situation I put myself in to fight her was not a good day. Harpy! Mosquito guy. Oh, the mosquito guy's name is Phantom. There's a man here wearing incredibly short shorts and a tunic that does not cover his incredibly short shorts. Okay. <laughs> hey, some people like short shorts. This guy likes short shorts. Nothing wrong with liking short shorts. He likes short shorts. Come back here, you dumb bird! Man, I sure keeps opening trap chests. Hit him. Hit him. Okay, we're good. I really like 
like this old guy covered in flowers. He's just so happy. <laughs> to dungeon! One who lives on extremes becomes extreme! Everybody in this group is so happy! <laughs> They're all such a bunch of happy orcs! I do like happy people. Uh, the entrance is on one side of this. Let's go to dungeon! Somebody mentioned a Waluigi dating sim, and that terrifies me? That's... That's a thing of beauty that it exists at all. <laughs> I'm, like, terrified and amazed. Okay, where are we going? We're going this way, I guess. Don't judge my methods, world. <laughs> yeah, somebody mentioned tofu. I'd like to get back to tofu, given the option, but... Honestly, I'm spending all my time right now just getting Isami up to par. <laughs> I don't see myself getting back to Tofu anytime soon. So one of these orcs is like, we should give our group a name. <laughs> and then the, the first guy that I met just starts spouting these awful name <laughs> suggestions. And then the other guy goes, are there any suggestions which are not distinctly terrible? <laughs> I'm gonna... Suggest... Choose a thematic word, such as Highland, Tuscan, Warsong, or Green- Okay. What is- what is a thematic word? Chat, you're gonna help me name this group. Oh boy. Chat, what is a thematic word? I- I'm guessing, like, an adjective or something. Something with theme. It doesn't really matter which way we go. I'm gonna link to this. This is the dating sim. Siestas? It's a noun. Okay, something that's not a noun. Gruntle. <laughs> you help too. I don't know. Uh. I don't know how to th I don't know how to thematic word. Berry is the most thematic word. <laughs> like, what's, what even is a thematic word? I, I don't know. Like, an adjective or something? Um... I like radiant. Wistfully. Wistfully? Wistful would work grammatically with this. Oh, okay. I think wistfully is like an adverb. I don't know words, man. Sidewater. I like radiant. I'm gonna go with radiant. Somebody said Professor Litwick suggested radiant. Slant water. Slant water. <laughs> you know what? I like that one. What if I- I can maybe do Radiant Slant Water. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 go that way, we gotta go down. Sparkling. Sparkling Slant Water. <laughs> I'm suggesting the Radiant Slant Water. <laughs> Oh 
my gosh, they're naming it that. Oh. <laughs> it's like a 50-50 vote. Advent Azure says butt knocker. <laughs> Radiant sparkling slant water. I can't I can only do two words. Oh man, from now on we're the radiant slant water. <laughs> oh boy. Yes. Yes. They had to vote. Mm. It was a vote of six to three in favor of radiant slant water. I like that the NPCs in this game, like, really interact with you. Mm. Like, they have their own opinions on crap. Butt water. Butt water! <laughs> Ew. There's the AC. <laughs> Somebody goes, keyword slant water, ten letters. <laughs> I don't know if there's a random number- I'm sure there's a random number generator for this particular thing, because it's just me typing and I'm not sure they can parse that. Um, although they might be able to parse for like swear words and be like, really you're gonna name it that? Mm. Um, but I'm sure for most things each character has their own distinct like personality. What type of voice do I picture Miss Naka having? A pretty, a pretty standard... Pretty average, like, anime lady voice. <laughs> and by average, I mean a lot of anime characters you hear have a really high-pitched voice. Actually, I shouldn't even say that. They're intentionally ex like, voices pushed intentionally to the extremes. So you'll have a lady who sounds really womanly. You'll have a lady who sounds really mature. You'll have a lady who sounds really young. Like, it's hard to find a good anime voice who sounds... average. But, like, if one existed. Um, there's actually a song that I thought was... There's a song I heard somewhere that I thought was alright. Um... Lamb. If you can search on YouTube for it. It... The song itself is called Lamb. Like, dot L-A-M-B. I don't know why the dot's in there. It's dot lamb. <laughs> But, like, th I think that's one of the closer things that I've heard so far. Oh, this guy's a selkie. Those are, like, mythological creatures and stuff. I'm pretty sure this guy is blind. One dollar in from Professor Litwick, who says, Yay, I helped out Barry do a thing. Also, I don't know if you base it off the highest single donation or highest total, but keyword, radiant or slant water. Yes. <laughs> I vote for those. I do believe that actually puts Professor Litwick in the lead, since I do count for totals. If you it's donate tied. multiple times. Uh, he donated earlier. Oh, he did? I'm still putting in Kaioken's keyword anyway. <laughs> so. Wait. Somebody just tweeted at the both of us radiant slant water. 
Burn. Okay, burn. Delta radiant sparkling slant water. <laughs> Um, average for Japanese voice actors or average for dub voice actors? Um, Japanese voice actors. Again, though, it's hard to find an average because, like, when you think of, like, oh, this is a good average, it's, like, super... It's, like, super high-pitched and it doesn't sound right. It doesn't sound good. Okay, we're, all, we're on the second floor and we lost Azure. This is... A five-floor dungeon? I say we just head out. Yeah, I say we just head out. Like, otherwise it's just the two of us going through a five-floor dungeon. Okay, somebody suggested a couple of voice actors. Um, keep those in mind, because I'm going to forget them. I may try to give them a look later on, and I can tell you what I like or not about them. Uh, that said, though, we've still got like 20 minutes. So if somebody else wants to hop on... Um, I'm actually going to... While we're waiting for somebody else to hop on... I'm actually going to real quick go... Hey, Notepad. Write down them voice actors. Yeah, somebody said Miyuki Saw Sawashiro. Did somebody mention somebody else? I think somebody did. Uh, Norio Wakamoto. Azure's back. Oh, man. Miyuki... Somebody said Yagyu Jube from Gintama. I guess I'll give that a look. I don't know who the voice actor for that is. No, then he said, wait, no, Noria Wakama. Yeah, I'll, you know what? I'll check both. Why not? This guy is a poet. Okay, I've got three names. I may look at them later. But... We got the band back together. Let's go! Oh, somebody's busy. Oh, no one's not. Warp history! Going back! Same place! Let's just book! Okay, we're booking. Going straight to dungeon. Let's go to dungeon. Eri Kiratamura. Um, I'd give it a look. I can't at the moment. We're running places. <laughs> See you there, suckers. I don't know. I think we're closer than you are. I think we're gonna beat you there, Azure. Oh no, we triggered a portal. Well, I'm gonna keep running. Hope they leave me alone. Oh, Azure is getting wrecked too. Enemies! Stop the magic! Uh. Ow. Okay, that guy's already dead. I think there's another guy. Ooh. 
Let's go to dungeon. Uh, what did I think about the story of Tiamat and Bahamut in 14? I thought that was actually kind of cool. Because I know, like, Tiamat and Bahamut have always kind of been... parallels to each other. Like, they've always been paired to each other in some way, be it, like, rivals or what have you, and... I thought that was super cool. Okay, I don't have the thing up, so I have no idea where we're going. We're going left. What about Isami Final Fantasy XIV's voice? Um, well, I got to choose a voice in the first place, and that one's a little more... That one's a little higher pitched. Japanese anime lady voice, but it's not like crazy irritating high pitched. Like berries. I guess. <laughs> Didn't you like intentionally go for the highest pitch one you could find? Yeah, because she's tiny. Yeah. Not the highest pitch one I could find. Mm. The one that wasn't insufferable. Yeah. I imagine Isami or 14 Isami wouldn't talk much though. Being kind of silent protagonist type. <laughs> Smile and nod. Oh, yeah, you're just going to give me a yeah. So are you going to offer any rebuttal to that, or just give me another one of your stoic nods? Nod. Uh, oh, this is going to be a long run. Stab and flying, guys! Would I consider Tofu having Nanako's voice actor? Hmm. Tofu would have a really high-pitched voice, and would she would probably be very nervous and very soft-spoken. <laughs> it would be high-pitched. It wouldn't be annoying, though. If anything, it would be... So, like, it wouldn't be, like, screechy high-pitched. But it would be high-pitched enough to be... Like, obviously from a tiny person. What is my taste in anime female voices? I don't have much taste. I don't, I don't really care. Don't be annoying. That's my only real qualification. Am I playing this from a PS2? I am indeed. Which thankfully is why I don't have to worry about disconnecting. Though theoretically they did work on getting that fixed and we needed to look into that. Apparently, um, Fester Sandwich wants one of us or both of us to hop onto Trove after the stream. Okay. There's apparently a thing, um, one of the things that creates new land hmm. in the Who's a What's-It's Place, in hmm. Peach Boot. 
I'll probably hop on and do okay. the thing. Well, if you're gonna take care of that, that, or if that's just what it is, then I'll let you take care okay. of that. Have I fully recorded Xenoverse? I have not. We did record far enough ahead, though, that I we didn't need to record this week. We just took the week off. Uh, we've recorded so far all of the parallel quests after the Cells saga. So next up is recording the Android Saga. Xenoverse handles those two out of order. I mean, I guess technically they're not out of order, but like they kind of skipped over the original Android Saga so they can handle the second Android Saga. Complicated. Time travel, yo. <laughs> Um, Ogre is doing pretty all right, Starboy. He's uh, he's actually been feeling a lot better lately. Uh, Duang wants to know, can I become an architect to help Carrot without, uh, with Carrot something with in Trove? Uh, you'd have to ask Barry for that one. What? Duang wants to know if he can be an architect so we can help Duang out with something. Okay. I've been a bit more wary to do that because of all the crap going on around, uh, Spawn. Yeah. Kind of recently, but... Just don't screw with spawn. Yeah. Do that and you're... whatever. <laughs> Dumb bird. Dumb bird! I want this game to be a thing so bad. <laughs> it was really nice. Oh, is it over already? Yeah. That was, it was quick. Well, it was the first day of 14. Hmm. Um, the game's currently in development. It has a Patreon funding its development. Hmm. I've known about it for a while. I don't remember when it started. I think during, like, Ludum Dare or something. It may have started. Or, hmm. like, soon after. But I remember hearing about it, and like, just the the way that they went into developing it, and the characters and everything was super interesting. Man, that lady got wrecked. Oh, no. Turn it, Azur! Training! <laughs> Don't interfere! I interfered if only so I didn't have to hear that hear that beeping. Um, my boyfriend and I are interested in playing Fragment, but we are not sure of where to begin. Are the servers private and cost money, or can we play for free? Um, 
the servers are certainly free. It's just a program that you can download and run on your computer. The only cost, if you want to say there's a cost, is um, legally you're supposed to have a copy of the original fragment disc to play the game, but like, it's just like any emulation. Nobody gives a crap. <laughs> so it, it's free, is what I'm saying. It's completely free. Um, it is a little bit of a headache to get started, so keep that in mind. Okay, where are we going? There's a lot of places we can go. I think we're going left, though. There's not much to the right. There must be some law of the universe that says you find 99% of bugs in a game within the hour you plan on building a distributable. <laughs> That's true. Uh, so wait, I can play this on the computer? Yes, you have to do it through a PlayStation 2 emulator, but you can. Um, of note, the PS2 emulators aren't as reliable, so to say, with netcode. Uh, they're not as reliable with netcode, so you may disconnect more often. Yay, we're done! We did it! We beat the thing! Uh, I don't know, we got a little bit of time. Let's clear out, like, this section over here. The guy who created the orc dating sim goes, Can someone hit me up when they finish playing Tusk the Tusks preview so I can shake the feeling that I accidentally uploaded, like, empty space dot zip? <laughs> <laughs> I'd use more skills, but all my skills take so much SP. I made over 9,000. Dang it, Asher. So how am I enjoying the Genova server? Um, I am, I'm rather enjoying it so far. Like, it doesn't have, it's not as populated. It doesn't have nearly as many players doing, like, hardcore endgame stuff. But, I don't know, something about it just feels more... friendly, I guess. Like, more personable. Instead of just this wall of leetness that f hang this, like, air of leetness that just hangs in the air. Like, it feels like it's just a bunch of guys just out having fun to doing their- doing their thing. Oh, Kaiser did a thing. Oh boy. You two save me for a second. Ooh, fancy. Whoa, what is this? Is it that one or is it this one? I think it's this one. There we go. Okay, guys, that's what Kaiser drew. That is fancy. That's the, uh, uh that's the villain, villainous lady from Hyrule Warriors. Oh. And, like, 
three odd shadow links. <laughs> that is super cool looking though. Look at that crap. Kaiser has a Patreon, by the way, if anybody wanted to support him. If I had money, I would pay Kaiser to do game art. For, because, for like, games. this is this is the stuff if you want to support him. Also, Barry has a Patreon if you want to support her in making fun, silly games. I do have a Patreon. I need to pay student loans. Oh, boy. <laughs> Someone asked if I could hop on Trove now. I can do that. Okay, back to what we were doing. Thank you for covering me. Um, am I planning on making a video about Alexander? I actually could, and I may. Um, it depends what it takes to get through it. Because right now, the only thing that I would be doing, I don't know how if I'm gonna be tackling the extreme mode primals. As far as like the, as far as like videos go. So, I just don't know. And right now, there's only the two expert dungeons. So, we're going to see how Alexander goes. But honest to goodness, if, I'm, if all I'm doing is the expert dungeons, then it doesn't feel like there's much point in me even continuing dancing with primals. But if Alexander is a thing that I can realistically do, not like, not like Alexander Savage or anything, that'd be ridiculous, but like regular Alexander, if it's a thing that I can do, then I would actually consider, I would actually consider continuing. Because like, I can do the dungeon super easy, that's not, a, that's not too big of a challenge. All the heels. Alright, guys, I think we're about done here. Just gonna keep getting stuff cast on me. Five dollars in from Moonstone, who just says, for you. <laughs> That's very Moonstone-like. It is. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Moonstone. We'll leave eventually, maybe. So how about that Terraria 1.3? I've not actually tackled Terraria since the update. I was really big into Terraria for a while. Um, then I kind of... I don't know, I think I overexerted myself into uh, Terraria. Because like now I honestly just don't I just don't care anymore. I've got enough to do otherwise though that I'm not too concerned. All right, so that was cool. Thank you very much for you guys for showing up. I'm gonna take a, just a brief moment now, at the end, to actually look through some of these voice actors. I'm downloading what seems to be a pretty extensive Trove update. Okay, let's see what I can let's see what I can come up with. What was suggested? One was... Uh, Miyuki Sawashiro was one. Compilation of roles. This hardly counts. Uh. Can we get to something that's actually, like, speaking? There we go. This, is, this doesn't help either, it's grunting.
Can I get not grunting? あ、今日はこの後たまってしまった録画の紹介をしたい。またこんど。え、おしでサルティ。セルティは本当にテレビが好きだね。何しも優平君、俺とるよな。私もこの子の演技が好きだけど。地蔵君の弟だよ。ここ
It, it, for one, it's too deep. I also feel like it sounds a little too... It, it sounds a bit... It's, it's too deep and it sounds a little too... Um, um, what's the word for it? What's that one where like... It's like the, it's like the lady school delinquent... That, like, you dressed up as in Persona 4. <laughs> like, what's the word for that? I don't know. Because it sounds too that as well. Like, it's too deep and it's too that. Just bored. Like, there's actually a word for it. Uh, she uh, was a not little... Not all the cupcakes. She not was a little cupcakes. bored, one so cupcake. there was that. But, um... One... You know, I'm gonna try to find it. One cupcake. Because I give everybody I trade with one cupcake. Um, okay. So, Professor Litwick. Oh, maybe that's it. It's that Yang Yankee thing. Let me go look for that. Invite yeah. Professor Litwick. Yankee. Yeah. Maybe. That sounds right. <laughs> um. Somebody was building a thing. There are statues on top of the trees next to yeah. spawn. Y-A-N-K-I is another spelling. But it's like a delinquent kind of thing. And a beautiful horse. Oh boy. But it is that like yan yan ki thing. Which I'm certain the word comes from Yankee. Pinata party pit. Which is a western thing. But like, yeah, that's that. That is that and that sounds it's too deep and it's too that. Um I mean, as I said before, the honestly the closest thing Oh no, it's lamb dot. Uh somebody else wants to join the club world. Of course you can't find it. Because who names a song Lamb with a dot after it? <laughs> um this is one this is one of the grant this is singing? So it's really hard to place what the person actually sent would sound like speaking and not singing. And this still isn't spot on, but I think this is one of the closest ones. Um. Not the beginning either. It's like you gotta get into it a little bit. Let's also turn it down some. Okay, that's, it's singing, so it's really hard to place, but I would say, like, a speaking version of that. That's still not spot on, but it's, like, the closest I've heard so far. So that's what I got. I don't know how to get down from here. This is kind of neat, though. Hmm. Oh, I found a way down. <laughs> it's not over spawn, so it's technically following the rules. So that was that. Um, who was singing that? I, it's a band. I think the band is called. I don't know. I don't know what the band is called. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I can't tell you. <laughs> the song is called Lamb. It says vocals were done by. Garnadelia, and then there's Japanese characters, and then it says, and Maria. 
they all have various lower and capital letters throughout them, and it's confusing. The music is by a couple Japanese characters. The lyrics are by that same Maria person. Okay, um... Whoa, where is this? Okay, Kaiser links. Kaiser links a video. <laughs> this is hyper hyper dimension Neptunia for anybody curious. Okay, where can I put this? Way too rough. Way too rough for Miss Naka. Yeah, this is Naka. Right, carrot sticks, links. Can I get to one where she's not doing a weird thing with her voice? You mean, don't call it a weird thing. I just want to hear a person talking. It doesn't help because, like, that kind of thing is not a thing that Miss Naka would do. <laughs> so, like, it's hard to say, like, yeah, that sounds about right, when, like, no, that's... that wouldn't happen. <laughs> Can we get back to the lady? I can't tell. The way she uses her voice is not a way Miss Naka would speak. <laughs> so it's really hard for me to, like, put a pin on the voice. <laughs> way too much variance, though. Like, it's trying to be cute and not relaxed. You're so specific. <laughs> I am. I'm. I'm. <laughs> it's like yes, yes, yes. I am. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna head out. Giant pink berry. Giant pink berry. Good night, everybody. Thank you very much, everybody, for showing up. It's been super fun. We got to play games and do all kinds of fun stuff. It was great. Thank you to everybody who showed up in the chat that I could talk to. Sorry I didn't do a lot of talking with you. Um, thank you very much to everybody who donated. I am going to be adding at least two keywords after we're done tonight. So that's going to be super great. But, um, yeah. Thank you very much, everybody, for showing up. Thank you to everybody in the chat. Thank you to the people who logged in, uh, playing alongside us. Thank you to the people who donated. It's been super fun. See everybody next week. Good night.